When you use a ray diagram to locate and describe the image of an object in a curved mirror, the problem with the ray diagram is it's not accurate. First of all, your pencil might not be sharp enough. But quite besides that, because you're not, you haven't necessarily used a compass to get the exact curvature of that mirror right, for a variety of reasons, you may be inaccurate. So what we want to do is use some algebra, use some formulas to get exact answers. Now, we start with magnification. This is the definition of magnification. It's the ratio of the height of the image to the height of the object. For example, your image might be twice the size of the object, or it might be one third of the size. That's, that's what magnification means. What we're going to do is actually work out the magnification using a different formula. This one on the left here is called the mirror formula. I am not going to attempt here to show you how come it works. If you want to know how, why it works, where it comes from, go and Google it, find a good video for the derivation of the mirror formula. It's worth doing, it's interesting, it involves algebra and geometry, I'm not going to try and do it here. Just use this formula to solve the problems. This tells me the position of the image, and then this one helps me work out the magnification, the size of the image. What is all this f, u, and v? f is the focal length of the lens. Sorry, the mirror. f is the focal length of the mirror. u is the distance from the mirror to the object. And V is the distance from the mirror to the image. Let me say that again. F is the focal length. U is the object distance. V is the image distance. Now, because concave and convex mirrors behave differently, we need some convention so that this formula always works for us. And our convention is that all measurements on the object side of the mirror are positive. And any measurement behind the mirror is negative. Be careful. For a convex mirror, the focal point is actually behind the mirror, which means F is negative for a convex mirror, a diverging mirror. 